What's up, everybody? This your boy A Dog, and once again, I'm back with another video. Today, we're gonna be checking out how white liberals really view black voters. Now, before we get to the video, if you're new to the channel, be sure you hit the subscribe button, turn on your notifications so you don't miss out on any of my videos. Without further ado, let's go ahead and dive straight into this, y'all. Let's go. I'm Ami Horowitz, and I'm here in Berkeley, California, to find out if voter ID laws suppress the black vote. Okay. I ain't me on the street. Do you have an opinion on voter ID laws? Uh, yeah, they're usually pretty racist, and <laughs> they're bad. I think voter ID laws are a way to perpetuate racism. Would you say they're, would you go as far as to say they're, they're, those laws are racist? For sure. Do you think it suppresses the uh, African American vote? Definitely. Uh, because they're less likely to have state IDs. Minority voters are less likely to have the kinds of IDs that have been um, described or required. These type of people don't live in areas with easy access to DMVs or other places where they can get identification. You can always get IDs um, you do over the internet. Does that also would make it difficult for, for black people in particular? Yeah, you have to have access to the internet. You have to be able to pay an internet service provider for certain fees. Do you think that's harder for black people to go online? Well, IDs? I feel like they don't have the knowledge of how, of like, how it works. A lot of people have smart... We don't have... Whoa! <laughs> she said we don't have the knowledge of how it works. Is she talking about... She basically talking about we don't have the knowledge to know how the internet works? Let me take that back. Hold on. I think that's harder for black people to go online? Black people in particular? Yeah, you have to have access to the internet. You have to be able to pay an okay. internet service provider for certain fees. Do you think that's harder for black people to go online? Well, I feel like they don't have the knowledge of how of like how it works. Like, a lot of people have smartphones, but you might not have data. For most of the communities, they don't really know what is out there just because they're not aware or like right. they're not informed. I also think there's a repression of like black voting with um, how they, how if you're a convicted felon, like you're not allowed to vote and everything. And when you look at swing states like Florida, that's a huge population of the of the like African Americans. Now I'm here in East Harlem mm. to ask Black people their thoughts on what you just heard. Okay. Do you have ID normally? You carry ID around? Yes, I have state ID. Do you carry ID? Yes, I do. Do you know anybody, who, any Black person, who doesn't carry ID? No. Everyone that I know has an ID. Why would they think we don't have ID? <laughs> That's a lie. Why would they say that? Do you have ID? Yes. Because I have my ID and my friends have their ID, so like, we know what we need to carry around. Right. Yeah, everybody that I know have ID. Like, that's one of the things you need to walk around with New York yeah, with. Yeah, you do. That's the main thing, bro. Like, uh, you do need to have ID. And a lot of us black people, we do have ID. <laughs> but I know they going around and just asking questions and stuff like that, but... uh. Yeah, we do have ID, and then the other girl, I think she was like, we didn't like, we didn't have any knowledge or something like, as far as being on the internet. I think we have plenty of knowledge, you know. But uh, yes, it is like he said though, it is good to have ID, no matter where you're going, black, white, green, yellow. It's good to have ID, cause you just never know you can get pulled over. They think you this person, or they think you that person. That's why it's so important to have ID. You just never know. You just never know. With ID. Do you know any black adult who does not have ID? No, I don't. Is it a weird thing to even say that? Yes, it is. What is this? Some, some type of uh, trick candy camera? Or I like know, that? right? <laughs> That's the only thing I brought with me. Those legit, yeah. legit IDs. I heard a lot also that uh, black people can't figure out how to get to the DMV. Really? Is that, is that, what does that say to you? I know it's that. It's on 25th Street. Do you know where the ID, the, the DMV is around you? It's on 125th Street and 3rd Avenue, I believe. You know where to get there? Yeah. Do you have a problem getting there if you have to get there? No. <laughs> I know these sound like silly questions. You know how to get the AV? Of course. You know where it is? Yes. You can get there? Uh-huh. No problem. No problem. Let's check it. Okay. <laughs> and I also heard a lot that black people, especially poor black people, have no access to the internet, can't figure out how to use the internet. What? <laughs> that's, that's, a, that's just stupidity. Yeah, that's crazy, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I still stuck on that when she was saying, like, Black black people don't have the knowledge of how to use the internet, which I don't look at it like that. I mean, anybody that's smart enough that knows. I know, I understand that everybody probably don't know how to use the internet that good, but I mean, come on now. Come on now. It's really self-explanatory when it comes to saying uh, black people don't know how to use the internet or don't know how to, you know what I'm saying? Come on. <laughs> that's nonsense there. 
But let's go. But like I said, I know he just asking questions just to see because I like how he did. He asked like uh, some white people, and then now he asked like some black people to kind of get both sides. You know what I'm saying? But let's go. Because like I said, it can be like on the white side. It can be some white people that don't know how to use the internet. It can be some black people that don't know how to use the internet. It can be black people that know how to use the internet. It can be white people that know how to. See, they can just go both ways, you know? That's, a, that's just stupidity, honestly. Everybody has access to the internet. Even a little kid can figure out how to work the internet. <laughs> I had access to the internet for years. Know how to use it properly, exactly. right? Exactly. I do it at work. So, of course, I know how to use it. My kids know how to use it. They all have iPads, iPods, whatever. Yeah. Your phone has data? Mm -hmm. You can actually unlimited. Internet. Unlimited data. Mm -hmm. I use my phone as a hotspot. What does that say to you for the people who have this perception of black people? Um, uh, they're pretty much ignorant now. That's why my thought process on. I just think that's ignorant. 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 That's the word. Very, I hear very a lot. ignorant. It's like everybody saying ignorant. Very, very ignorant. Does it sound racist for somebody to say that? I, I think it is a little racist because you know you're putting um, people in a category and you have no idea what you're talking about. Maybe a little bit of racist in it, but like I said, I think it's more stupidity and ignorance. You're judging somebody like, but you're judging them because they're black, saying that they don't got it. Yeah. What people are they talking to? <laughs> what are who are these people talking to? Do you have a problem that if you go to vote and they say, can we please see your ID to make sure you are who you say you are? I you love cool? showing my ID. You have no problem with that? Yeah. Nope. Would you have a problem if when you go to vote, if they say, can we please just see your ID to make sure you are who you say you are? Do you have an issue with that? No. Would you have a problem if there was a rule where you have to show your ID? I, guess I, wouldn't, I wouldn't have a problem with that. I want to show my ID. I want you to know who I am. I don't want you mistaking me for nobody. You know what I'm saying? But like I said, it is very, very important to have an ID. And like I said, that's that right there goes for anybody. It's very important to have an ID. So like I said, if I go somewhere, just like when you get pulled over and the police ask you, hey, let me see your ID. Yes, here. You know what I'm saying? So I I, I think it's very important to have an ID though. I don't think so, no. Would you have an issue if there was a rule saying you gotta show your ID before you vote? No. Are you cool with that? Yeah. Well, well, all right, y'all. Like I said, y'all let me know what y'all thought about it in the comments section. But, you know what I'm saying? I understand he was just asking both sides to kind of get perceptions and stuff like that. But I, I did find it stupid to say that black people don't know how to use the Internet. That was crazy, though. That was crazy. But, look, y'all, we have made it to the end of the video. If you did enjoy, please hit the like button. Subscribe to the channel if you're new with your notifications turned on. It's your boy A-Dog. I'm going to catch y'all in the next one.